By your sweet princess Sitka. Ciao, ciao. Here I am, your sweet princess Sitka. Generously kind, silky, soft, and smooth, sharing myself with you, my intelligence. So, why did I say it? That the fall of the wall was a disaster? Or did I just say it in my previous video? What just think about it? So there's west and there is east. And they were separated. And now the wall opened. And what happened? Interesting enough, this reel said it recently. In Germany, when you have money, you leave Germany. That is a new, not when I lived there. And when you don't have money, you move to Germany. It is the disaster because of the mentalities which fills Germany and the rest of the Europe. That's why. Germany important in Europe as an advanced civilization in technology and advancement because of the high quality of the products. There is a work ethic behind it. There is the ethic and moral code, the code, how people act and interact with each other and respect and might be rude for you to see, or particularly if you're Latin, to come into a German household and they tell you, we are just eating, can you please take seat in another room and wa wait for your friend. It is rude. Because why not say, please have a seat and eat with us. Correct. So I'm not glorifying Germany as a nation. I'm just pointing out a few things. The strictly handing out quality work and the absolute utter respect of each other. That's what I'm talking about. Respect of each other and their privacy, of course. And that's why Germany is large. And Spain, not that large, but it was okay. And Italy particularly in the north, they have high strict co codes too, moral codes and quality codes. Yeah, almost like a handshake used to be okay to conclude a business. And all the other countries are just the same, Sweden, Finland, Norwegian, Denmark, Holland, Belgium. Yeah, in France, uh, yeah, okay, in comparison to the east, uh, it worked, didn't it now? Oh yeah, that engineer I met in Toulouse, I think he was well done, then again, I think he was well done. He had a nice apartment, modern, very well furnished, I had a good car for France, I think. I don't remember which car, but you don't have large cars in Europe, but it wasn't tiny, tiny either. I don't know, I don't, I don't look at, I definitely you know he's French, right? I don't know, I just assume it. He had it in a very modern place, a good job, I, I think so. I think that was the one where he worked, I'm not quite sure. Space shuttle, what did that do there? Very important company, right? But it worked, France, in many ways. It stopped working when the Arabs came. Because of the French having invaded Africa, there are though very many countries in Africa, the Arab world, where they speak French. So when things got astray in their places, they would move. Yeah, black people, Arab people, bearded people, they would move to France. And where did England invade it? Those was more, you go to England. In Germany, the Turks were invited and they adjusted. They took their employment, which they had been offered. Yeah, when was that in the 50s, 60s? I don't know. Invited to work there, to work there guests in our country to work at the time they didn't really thought that true but the Turks kept their heads low they kept to themselves and the new Turks born now of these Turkish families in Germany they had to adjust it's different but once the borders were open immigrants flew were floating into the west why 
the tallest people on earth are the ones like in Russia. Russia or whatever you call this Soviet Union, doesn't matter which part. Even the Arab people, they're tall men, strongly built. And that's what you see, Poland, which were German too in a part, partially, Prussian, right? Prussia. And Romania, Bulgaria, Czechoslovakia, Hungary, those are tall people. Strong men and women. Oh yeah, the green-eyed waitress, she was very tall and slim. And she was not stupid, she had intellect. Yeah, she probably was some philosopher even, or school teacher, or had the capacity of. And, oh, she would have made a great couple with Robert, but she was too stingy. <laughs> well, he was too old for her. Point is, why would people not make life in their own place? I tell you why. Because they're lazy. Because they are used to be provided. And, and that is the main reason, because they're cheats. They're cheating people. Starting in Poland, the Slovakian people. Yeah, just for starters. Those people cheat and lie. They sell you an idea and they mean business and just they steal from you. They do bad quality. They don't have appreciation or love for themselves, for each other or for the work they do because they were not pressured in the capitalistic system to enhance good quality and because they were not shown in the communist system to be nice and sweet and kind to each other because religion wasn't allowed and in capitalism at least there was the underlying notion in certain places that you had to be good that's to being a cheat cheat is not okay it doesn't mean that Mexicans understood that but in the Arab world to be good is not even an issue. You should not be good. You should be bad and mean. The meanest motherfucker is the greatest of success in the Arab world. Yeah, is that Muslim? I don't know. The more you can cheat and lie, the better you're off. Okay, so the deeper the religion, the more the people will become cheats. Because Lutheran and reformists, yeah, the people who founded the Americas, right? The United States. Those is the anti-religion. You haven't really quite gotten that yet. People used to live in peace and harmony, creating their little homes by working the land and sharing what they had. And then Catholicism came to rob them blind. So the Lutheran movement was against religion, reformist to reform from, you know, an illegal way not to be murdered from inside. So they had to kind of copy a few of the Catholic places, hence the Bible, to be mildly accepted and not completely murdered as, how do you call them, heretics, right? But it is mainly an anti-religion, which also allows marriages where people share and are honest with each other. But other than that, baptism, that's the same, right? Other than that, all religion points out to being cheating and lying people. Get it? And that is what brought Europe down. The opening of the war in the immigrants who now disturbed, destroyed, and destructed and murdered the entire ethical code. That's why. I get so weak in the knees I can hardly speak I lose all control And something takes over me In a daze Your love's so amazing It's not a phase I want you to stay with me By your side I swallow my pride Your love is so sweet 